Hello, I'm Andy Kilder with the Gilmer County, Georgia Office of Public Safety here to demonstrate the proper use of steps in a rented cabin facility. Let's take a look inside and see the, the, the very basic techniques uh, to be mindful of when approaching steps. Here we have the actual scene of the accident and you can tell that the uh, police tape is still down here. And uh, again, just a warning and this entire public service announcement is all about public safety. Um, Andy Kilder, could you show me what some proper techniques would be for um, step climbing or descending? Yes. Obviously you want to use the handrail if that's uh, provided. Okay. So use a handrail. It's great if you have a handrail on both sides. This one obviously only has one. Uh, so you want to use a hand over hand motion coming up the steps. Thank you very much. Okay, uh, Hannah is uh, going to be helping us out today with demonstrating uh, what not to do in this situation. Now Hannah has uh, just graciously agreed to don the same swimming wear as the victim. Uh, obviously we had to um, augment her with uh, quite a bit of stuffing to approximate the girth and the weight of uh, this large woman who did fall here. And uh, so again, this is a demonstration. Please do not try this at home. Okay. All right, the victim came down these steps wearing Crocs. Uh, the victim came down the steps wearing Crocs. Upon reaching this approximate position on the steps, her footing came out from under her. Her back hit and her head hit causing a concussion, hemorrhaging in the brain. She did have a gas discharge at this time, but that was not documented earlier. <laughs> As she began to moan, she couldn't... <laughs> she began to go, oh, oh. She lay here for at least nine minutes before help arrived and someone was able to pick her up and uh, take her upstairs to her couch.